Hello everyone. Uh, in this demo, <coughs> we will take a look at uh, integration uh, with S2I on Tamil site. So first, uh, what I will do, I will uh, use our command line uh, interface that is called Tamils to uh, list uh, S2I container images. And here you can see a table of uh, .S2I container images that are registered on the backend. And uh, besides uh, the container image name, version, you can find also uh, anal container image analysis information. So uh, if you uh, use smaller uh, font size uh, and you copy this analysis ID, you can reuse it in uh, our uh, endpoint, this endpoint on the user API and you provide uh, information about uh, analysis ID, then you can see information from our analyzer that states uh, all the packages that are found uh, in that specific container image, uh, where they are located, but also uh, besides Python packages, also RPM packages, uh, all the information. And if I will be... Yes, um, uh, you can also see information about uh, 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 symbols that are available inside uh, the container image. And these symbols are uh, then used in the recommendation engine to uh, filter out packages that require a certain ABI uh, that uh, should be provided by the base container image. Uh, this information is uh, used uh, or aggregated on uh, on the uh, user side when you uh, provide configuration file to Tamos. When I uh, open our configuration file by using Tamos config, you can see uh, there is an entry that is called base image, and uh, this uh, information is sent to the backend. Uh, so a backend can use uh, the pre-aggregated knowledge of uh, S2I uh, container images. Just to note here, if uh, you are using other container images uh, that are provided by uh, Dot uh, and built by AICOE uh, CI pipeline, uh, for example, if you use uh, Jupyter Notebook base image, uh, then uh, Tamos will automatically detect uh, that base image that you are running uh, some uh, Jupyter notebook. And in that case, uh, this information can be also used on the backend side to uh, provide better uh, recommendations. Uh, that's probably it. Do you have any questions? Yes. Um, so I think you said um, we can filter out packages that require specific ABI symbols, which are not present in the base container image. But the other way around, we can't do, right? Recommend a base image to satisfy the ABI symbols required by packages, correct? Correct, we cannot do that yet. Okay, cool. Thanks for the clarification and um, I guess we have that on the list for uh, an intern project to recommend the base image um, based on the ABI requirements, right? Yes. And uh, just to uh, show that we also provide information about the base images to, to users, so you can find this info field and that uh, links to uh, our uh, justification page. So, for example, here you can find, uh, find information about uh, TOT uh, Hydra 31 running Python 3.7 base container image. Cool. Any questions? Nice. Uh, thanks for that, Frido.